I'm going to step through some of the things that are happening in this show. I think you're all well aware of Chris's practice. I think you're all absolutely aware of this abiding talent, a great friend of the arts in South Australia, an exceptional mentor and educator. Margot said something very beautifully in the introduction to Chris's 2017 Sala monograph. Mm, yeah. Yep, 2017 Sala monograph. She mentions the fact, Margot Osborne, who's here tonight, she mentions the fact that the figure of the avatar is kind of busy doing something, but we don't quite know what. <laughs> very, very serious, but God knows what he's up to, right? <laughs> I feel like this new body of work, particularly the return to Fuginella, gives this sense of agency to the figure. Maybe we are all in many ways La Fuginella. We've all got work to do. We all have to find hope, find the light from the dark at this moment in time. So whilst there's a sense that we are here on comfortable ground with Chris's current exhibition, there's also a sense that it's leaning into something incredibly focused and new, without being didactic, full of hope, without directing us to a particular way of thinking and working. Christopher Orchard is an extraordinary talent in that he combines uncommon vision and skill to create art that captures the zeitgeist of our time while maintaining the highest formal qualities of painting and drawing. Rosenberg is essentially saying here is an artist who speaks to the spirit of our times whilst doing it with incredible kind of facility, with incredibly astute technical prowess. 